On Sunday, June the 7th, the feast of Corpus Christi in Jerusalem was celebrated a few meters from the Upper Room. The celebration took place at St. Francis's Monastery at the Upper Room, also known as the Cenacolino. Siamo radunati oggi qua, abbiamo celebrato il Corpus Domini qui in questo convento di San Francesco presso il Cenacolo, vicino al Cenacolo. In questo convento abbiamo due cappelle. We gathered here today and celebrated Corpus Christi in this monastery of St. Francis near the Upper Room. In this monastery there are two chapels. One is dedicated to the Eucharist and the Last Supper where the celebration took place. We also have the lower chapel that is dedicated to the Holy Spirit where we celebrated Mass a few days ago. Unable to go to the Upper Room to celebrate the Eucharist, we celebrated here in this monastery where we have a community of friars di cose di celebrative, soprattutto dell'Eucaristia in questo giorno, l'abbiamo celebrato qua in questo convento dove ci abbiamo una comunità di frati. After the Eucharistic celebration, the friars and concelebrants along with the faithful made a procession to the garden in order to pray. The blessing was imparted inside the chapel dedicated to the Holy Spirit. St. Francis's Monastery at the Upper Room on Mount Zion gives pilgrims the opportunity to celebrate the mysteries of the Last Supper just a few meters from the sanctuary, the first seat of the custody of the Holy Land. With the ever-increasing flow of pilgrims, the Franciscans decided to enlarge the areas used for celebrations. The community of friars serves groups of pilgrims who cannot attend Mass in the Upper Room and so instead celebrate here Holy Thursday's mystery of the gift of the Eucharist and the gift of the coming of the Spirit on the Church. The monastery has just been restored. The chapel with its adjacent garden, which has also recently been restored, is now a place of prayer and meditation, open to groups of pilgrims visiting the Holy City.